Good to go. Okay, great. So uh, this is Lauren Weinstein for Focus Generic. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. So um, what was your initial reaction when you read the script? Like, was there a specific aspect that made you want to go on board, like most attracted, attracted you to the project? Um, I thought the, the relationship between Grace and Maggie was interesting. I thought, it, you know, people would want to see what it takes to be, to work for somebody that's, you know, a superstar. Um, to me, that was the behind the curtains kind of aspect that a movie like this, you know, needs to have to work. Um, so that was what I thought was real interesting. And, and, you know, playing a character like Jack, um, you know, when I, when I thought about him, I just knew how I was going to play him because I've seen so many managers over my, my career. So. You know, what made me really want to do this movie and know that it was going to be good, I knew the relationship between Grace and Maggie would be something that the audience would really want to see. Cool. Um, so how do you prepare for this role? Like, did you have any special, special rituals to get into character? To prepare for this role, um, you know, I didn't really do anything out of the ordinary. You know, once I put on that suit, those glasses, pinky ring, and I had a drink in my hand, I was Jack. It was just, you know, naturally, you know, a guy who was a little pushy, you know, out forward um, and thinks he's the star in a way, you know, he, he thinks, no way in the world Grace Davis would be who Grace Davis is without him. So um, it was just really putting those glasses on and getting that drink in my hand. And uh, that's all I really needed. Nice. Um, do you feel like your character evolved from the start to finish? And if so, how? Well, I think my character, um, you know, did really evolve from start to finish because uh, he started off hating Maggie. And then, you know, by the end of the movie, um, he's mustered up um, some respect for. Her. And so that's a journey. Um, I think it's a journey uh, that is very relatable to anybody who works for any company or any group of people and, you know, the, the people at the top don't really get you yet. So, um, so it's very relatable. And I think, um, you know, that growth of, of a person you don't respect growing into a person you do respect, you know, is a, is a cool journey to see. Um, how are um, how did you collaborate with like the other actors, specifically the ones that you shared the most amount of scenes with? Well, I collaborated the most with Tracy. Um, I really made it a point to stay away from Dakota um, because um, you know I I really wanted to just see her as an assistant and, and me as a guy who chews assistants out and spits them, spits them out every day, you know, chews them up and spits them out. So I didn't really want to, you know, to lose that feeling. So, you know, I kind of you know, kept that at a distance, but I was really, you know, wanting to talk to Tracy and um, let her understand and get some kind of uh, chemistry. You know, we have met together. And so I wanted her to feel comfortable and not, you know, feel any kind of, uh, you know, reservations about, you know, how to interact with me. So I just wanted to, you know, work to make sure she was comfortable working with me.